Mr. President, overall, South Korea has done five times more tests than the U.S. per capita. Why is that? I don't think that's true. That, that is true. And you said this morning that the White House said the U.S. passes South Korea in virus true. testing. Who are you with? Uh, Yahoo News. And it's not true per capita. Uh, do you want to respond to that? So to our Yahoo gentlemen, I just want to make it clear that um, South Korea's testing was 11 per per 100,000, and we're at 17 per 100,000. So Are you going to apologize, Yahoo? That's why you're Yahoo, and nobody knows who that you are. Go ahead. Let's Based go, on Jim. the numbers I've, I've seen, that's, that's, that's why not... nobody knows who you are, including me. Go ahead. Mr. President, just, just check to... it again. Okay. You ought to get your facts right before you... Well, we have had, we have had 14 Okay, well, your facts are wrong. Now. I have a feeling that they'll ask me much nicer questions. They'll tone them down, right? And thank you for the apology. I appreciate it. That was very nice. Yahoo. I appreciate it. It was very nice. Uh, yeah, go ahead, Jim. Go ahead. Mr. President, overall, South Korea has done five times more tests than the U.S. per capita. Why is that? I don't think that's true. That, that is true. And you I said this morning that the White House said the U.S. passes South Korea in virus testing. Who are you with? Uh, Yahoo News. And it's not true per capita. Uh, do you want to respond to that, do you, if you have the numbers? Sure, I have the numbers. So, remember early on, we push test to the outbreak areas, just like he described. His primary outbreak was in Miami-Dade and Broward County and Palm Beach, so they pushed test into that region. We did the same thing in the United States. So if you look at every single state that had an outbreak, their testing is greater than anywhere in the world. They're in the four per, you know, 42 per thousand range. Your, your point is taken about um, individual areas, but overall we've had 14 times more infections than South Korea. So are we doing something wrong and why is that? They have a very dense population. Yeah, our epidemic looks much more like the European epidemic. So right now we're tracking very close to the countries in Europe and we're testing at their rate of, of their concentrated epidemics and where they're occurring in the metros. I think it really shows the susceptibility of our major cities in the same way they were susceptible in Europe. And so we've been very focused on that. That's not to say so, that we're not Korea supporting the rural states. Cities, we're very much supporting the rural states and very much supporting their testing. There's no, there's no state right now in the United States that's tested really less than 1%, which is pretty remarkable when they don't really have significant cases. But we've been really working with states to do sentinel surveillance and also to reach out to our Native American populations as well as our inner city. So I think now that we've expanded testing dramatically and CDC has altered the criteria for testing, I think you'll see as, as governors have unlocked more and more potential in their laboratories, we know that we have more laboratory capacity. And you hear the governors talk about we have capacity and now we have to match um, things, you know, the resources that you need, the swabs and the extraction media with the capacity. And I think governors are well aware of how to expand testing now. And so we're in that partnership. That's what was announced yesterday. We want testing linked to critical contact tracing, but we also want testing as he described. The governor described a really important insight. He went where the virus could cause the most damage to human beings. And so he went into the nursing homes to really proactively test. And, and that's, that's true really also in our, throughout the country. Yes, and that's true in our, that's why it's in the blueprint. And I think some of the press didn't hear how much we were emphasizing the asymptomatic testing. We believe that's a critical part of this. We will be looking at this. So to yeah. our Yahoo gentlemen, I just want to make it clear that um, South Korea's testing was 11 per per 100,000, and we're at 17 per 100,000. Right. So Are you going to apologize, Yahoo? That's why you're Yahoo, and nobody knows who that you are. Okay. Go ahead. Let's Based go, on Jim. the numbers I've, I've seen, that's, that's, that's why not... nobody knows who you are, including me. Go ahead. Mr. President, just, just check to... it again. Okay. You ought to get your facts right before you... Well, we have had 14 Okay, well, your facts are wrong. Now.